The storm that barreled through Iowa on Monday flattened crops in central and eastern parts of the state. But here in Siouxland, it actually brought some welcome rain. KTIV's Hava Para has that story from Plymouth County. Uh, we're at a very important time for filling out corn and soybean crop. And we've been very short in much of northwest Iowa. So uh, we've been getting some yield losses due to the lack of rainfall. Field agronomist Joel DeYoung says most of northwest Iowa got anywhere from half an inch to over an inch of rainfall during Monday's storms. He says at this stage, any amount of rainfall is a plus. Every bit helps and some neighborhoods have just been doing way better than others. DeYoung says you can tell when crops are lacking water when the crops have dry leaves like these. You can also find what's referred to as aborted corn kernels on a cob. Aborted kernels shrink, are mostly white, and often with the yellow embryo visible, compared to normal plump yellow kernels. Uh, we still have a need for significantly more rain in northwest Iowa, preferably without hail and heavy winds included. DeYoung says most of northwest Iowa has not had much rain since the 1st of April. He says farmers had a really bad year in 2012, and northwest Iowa is about three inches of rainfall behind, compared to what they were in 2012. The differences are we started with good subsoil moisture this year, so we've had enough in storage to kind of sneak by, but we've seen uh, in the last couple, three weeks, we've seen the impact in fields that are really reducing our yield potential for this year. Reporting in Lamar's, Iowa, Havapara, KTIV News 4.